Here are your headlines from WCCO 4 News. I'm Amelia Santinello. Minnesota lawmakers return to the state capitol for the 2020 session today. One of the biggest issues the divided legislature is facing is what to do with the $1.3 billion surplus and how much of it should go towards tax relief or infrastructure improvements. Lawmakers are once again sharply divided on education spending and gun control. But both sides are optimistic they can find a way to lower insulin prices and want to address issues with the Department of Human Services. We have learned the name of the woman hit and killed by a car in St. Paul on Friday. Police identified the victim as 37-year-old Kevlin Hopkins. The driver was an 18-year-old woman who police say told them she smoked marijuana nine hours before the accident. Officers say that her eyes were bloodshot. She told them the victim had been walking in the street. The young woman was booked into jail before being released on Sunday and charges are pending. The Minnesota Wild are following the Timberwolves and Twins by getting in on the trade action. Jason Zucker is now a Pittsburgh Penguin. In return, the Penguins send center Alex Galchenyuk, defenseman Kalen Addison, and their 2020 first round draft pick. Zucker has 14 goals and 15 assists this season, but was recently demoted to the fourth line. The Wild are in St. Paul tonight for a game against the Las Vegas Golden Knights. For more news and weather, join us for WCCO 4 News, also streaming on CBSN Minnesota 24 hours a day at WCCO.com.